Good morning, YouTube. It is 4.10 on this Tuesday morning. Uh, today, for way too early for explanations, we're talking about uh, works with Nest. Yeah, <laughs> way too early. Or that Higgs chromosome space, the electrons, light, the magnetism, all particles, and momentum, super receptors, radiation, our mathematics, the solution, asteroid. What am I doing up? Um, so, <clears throat> I read an article the other day on how, so Nest is a, Nest Labs is a company that, that created, um, that, that had these thermostats and fire, uh, fire alarm systems that connected to your phone. Um, Google bought them out. And, uh, you know that whenever Google gets their hands on something, they're, they're going to go big. So what Google decided to do is, um, they're, they, they want to work on what they call the Internet of Things. Oh. And so they're really, <clears throat> they're really targeting, um, trying to develop a smart house. Uh, they've they've opened up the collaboration to say, hey, all you people that make house appliances, work with us. Um, try and get it. Try and get your product to to work with Nest. Um, and let's see if we can't develop a smart house. So, you know, they they already have. I think it was like 15 different partners um, of household. These are companies of household items. Saying, hey, we Google will develop the uh, the Nest protocol, and if you want to incorporate the Nest protocol into your product, we'll figure out a way to get these products to talk to each other. So, <coughs> excuse me. Um, as you can tell, I'm trying to get over a cold. Um, what they, you know, so things like. Uh, you know the thermostat connected to the security system. If you if you set your security system to a way, you know then your thermostat may alter the uh, temperature pattern to to save money or whatever. And then when you uh, when you come back home and and set your security system to home, then you know your temperature goes up or something like that. Or like if you have like a, a washer and dryer, you know, if you, if you leave the house and your security system is set to a way, then um, your washer and dryer may be set to normal, but then when you come back, um, your washer and dryer may be set to quiet mode or something like that. Um, so all these various things where, you know, appliances are linked and sort of talk to each other. Um, and that alters their settings or, or like, you know, there's one where, um, let's say your kid doesn't check in at the appropriate time, you know, you get a text saying, Hey, where's your kid or something like that, you know? So making, making these appliances connected and talk to each other, do a little bit of thinking and react change their behavior or maybe even inform you if uh, something is happening or isn't happening. So that was fun to read. Um, you know, we we talked about the smart city before with Amsterdam. It really does take a collaboration of, of different... Um, you know, you, you can try and go the solo route, which Google tried to do with cars because, you know, the, the car companies wouldn't uh, wouldn't play with them basically. Uh, but you know, in any, <clears throat> really the best way to do it is, is to have a collaboration because Google doesn't want to make all these appliances. 
they're really just into you know with the acquisition of Nest, they're they're really into the the Nest protocol. They don't make hardware. They don't you know their expertise is in in home appliances. That's everyone else's expertise. But with this collaboration, uh, we'll see some stuff get developed. So, uh, like I said, that was cool to read. Um, let's see here. I should go to work, but I may call in sick. Uh, I only spent a half day yesterday. That, that wasn't too fun. Uh, anyway, I'm going to go figure out what to do with my day. You're going to go do whatever it is you do. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Thank you for watching another episode of Way Too Early for Explanations. If you enjoyed it, please click on the like button down here. If you want to follow me on Instagram or Twitter, I'll post links at the bottom of the description field. If you want to subscribe to my channel, you can do so by clicking on the subscribe button around here. If you want to get to my channel to see more videos, you can click on the link to Way Too Early for Explanations, or you can click on the eye chart that shows up in the upper right hand corner. Every morning I try to kick out more videos, um, so stay tuned and come on back if you want to observe more early morning techno battle. Thanks again.